All right, so I ordered the Forever panels, which are like a thick ABS. I still have the stock panels, but they're cardboard and they rot because water gets down in there because nobody puts the plastic back on, which is literally called the vapor barrier. So water doesn't get through that and then ruin it. Um, and the clips that I had, obviously you're supposed to cover this in fabric so you don't see the clips and the holes and the whatnot. And I got grills to go over that guy. So I just got to put it all together. But the, um, the clips on Amazon and everywhere else that say they're the right ones, if you go in the reviews, you'll see literally every single review is one star saying that the, as soon as you try and pull them off, the heads just explode. And I can verify that with, all right, maybe I can't. Oh, there. Like these kits that come with literally everything. I tried those guys and they look very similar and they work on the way in but if you ever try and take them off the heads just pop right off so the guy that made the forever panels i found on a reddit post he said he used these um and that was for designing them and fitting them and unfitting you know taking them on and on and on and off and they never broke so that's the part number the place i ordered from took like a week just to get them to me but there's 50 in a box. They're only like $9, so don't pay more than that. I think that it was like 12 bucks shipped. But that's what you want. That guy right there. Excuse me. So the plan is, today, anyway, get these door panels back off, trim this hole, because it's kind of hitting the speaker. So when the speaker is vibrating, it's vibrating this. So I'm going to trim this back. A little bit I've got drills that screw to it after I wrap it in this and then put it all back together so here we go I'm gonna be using oh, this stuff here to hold it on so gotta get the door panels off I'm gonna use a drill just make it quick I just used a, uh, a tiny little flathead to pry this guy out and don't overpay for these if yours are like mine and they're starting to fall apart and rotted and plastic's getting brittle. Um, I think it's Pinterest, not Pinterest, idiot, uh, Printables or Thingiverse, one of them, uh, has a 3D print file for these. So should be able to print some up in a high temp, maybe ABS, I don't know. All right, driver's side panel is off. You can see there are the forever panels. Um, they come with every possible hole that all the different years, I think 90 all the way to 97, would have. And then you just go and uh, there's a video online. Take a socket or something bigger than the hole and a flathead and you just jam that fucker. And um, it'll just pop it right out. And then these are already all popped out. This is already popped out. So you don't have to do those. But then you pick what kind of speaker setup you want. Like my panels have the thing that goes here. So I could just knock this whole thing off. And then bolt that plastic thing to it that's a grill all in one. So I may do that. Um, and yeah, you just go around and punch out what you need. And then... You unscrew your stock panels from the top, and you just screw these back. There's also, if you Google it, again, printables or Thingiverse, one of them, there's repair uh, plastic that things that you can print that are like cups, basically. And you just crazy glue them or plastic weld them to those, and it'll repair the spots on this thing and make them more like a hole with you know threads again instead of blunt because these crack really bad i'll take it apart and you'll see so that one's kind of chewed up a little that's that one's toasty um that's what they should look like some of them are gonna be shattered some of them are completely missing so you know repair what you have to and then knock out the holes you need and then 
flip it over, you get this nice textured side that I believe will help the adhesive. So we're gonna, I don't know, I'm gonna see if those speaker grills line up better and uh, yeah. All right, I'm uh, losing my mind in my old age, I guess, because uh, that's just a grill. All right, so, hmm, good to know. All right, widen the hole. You can use a Dremel. I used a, uh, that thingy. Uh, yeah, and then uh, <clears throat> we're going to line this up. Clearly, we have enough, and... The instructions, which nobody ever reads, will tell you that you need to liberally coat, not this side obviously, the side that's going to get stuck to it, so we'll literally just flip it over like that. And then you blast this, and you blast that, and then you let it sit for whatever the can says, everybody's different. But that way it tacks up, and once it gets tacky, it's like contact cement. It's going to want to stick to that, you do both. And then you literally, so we're literally just going to flip it over and press it and then fold over the edges so it gets on the back. We'll have to put some on the back around the edge and let it tack up. And then that way we can fold it over, we'll let everything get nice and tacky. Then we'll go through here and we'll cut our holes for the uh, armrest and the speaker. And then same thing, we'll like fold it over around all the holes. Let it tack up fully before you stick it, though. That's the one thing everybody forgets to do, like when you're doing your headliner or whatever. So that's what we're going to do. All right. Nice, even layer. And on the fabric, you can't see it on the fabric, obviously, but letting that tack up, you'll kind of, it'll go from wet to you'll be pulling strings off of it. And then we just flip it, and I've got it magneted down so that the fabric is more like it, it compresses. So I don't want it to, I want it to be even all the way across. So there we go. Uh, stroke the furry ball. Got these screwed on nice and tight. They're plastic, so it just screwed right in. Now I can put the little clips everywhere. Screw it back to the top, wherever the, f oh, there it is. And then uh, put it back in. We'll see how she looks. And that, my friends, is how it's done. And, uh, nice. I'm going to knock out the other side, and then I'll get a little shot of it. And there you go. Like if you like, subscribe if you want to see more. And as always, keep on modding.